Hi, and welcome to the official PageRage video tutorials. My name is Jen, and I will be guiding you through our how-to video tutorial today. In today's video, we will be covering how PageRage users can go about clearing their cache. This is a common trick we, as well as our QA lab, uses in some cases when applying PageRage layouts. Clearing the cache on your computer is in direct correlation with problems some of our users see when using PageRage. For example, if you have installed PageRage on your computer and you've selected a layout and then you log into your Facebook account to see no layout applied, then this how-to video is just for you. So first things first, what is cache? So cache is a place to store uh, recently accessed data on your computer. So having cache makes surfing the internet quicker and more convenient for you. If you do not clear your cache often, all that stored data can pile up leaving you with slow internet surfing and page rage layouts that do not load right away. So here is how you can clear your cache using Internet Explorer. So make sure your Internet Explorer browser is open and um, to make sure on your keyboard you're going to hold down control shift delete and the delete browsing history window will pop up as you can see here. Make sure that temporary internet files, cookies, and history are checked. Um, all these other options, um, you can have them checked like I do or you can choose not to. Just make sure the top three are checked. So once you go through that, to save the changes, hit delete and now your cookies have been deleted successfully. Um, so to make sure that this did work, this action did work, um, we're going to select a layout from PageRage.com that we will want to apply to our layout. And just select any layout you see. And now I will log into my Facebook account to see if it worked. So logging into my Facebook account, go to your profile tab. Oh, and Internet Explorer, um, with the new IE9, they have um, a lot of notifications that pop up, so make sure that you read through those before you do any actions. So go to your profile page. And as you can see here, my layout has been applied. So if you do all these actions like we've instructed you to do so in this video tutorial and it still doesn't work, we recommend visiting our website. So if you just go to pagerage.com and click on the support page. We have frequently asked questions here that may help you out um, as well as remote support. So if you click on remote support, you can actually get in touch with our support team to ask specific questions if you didn't see them listed on the actual support page. Also, we would advise you to um, weekly read up on our blog. We post new blog stories every week so you guys can stay in touch with PageRage. Also, we advise you to follow us on Twitter and we have um, Twitter updates every day um, seven days a week, we give you layout updates of new layouts, um, new things that we've added to the website, etc. Also, uh, you can s um, follow us on our YouTube channel to stay in touch with um, whatever new video tutorials we come out with for PageRage. And if you're a MySpace member, you can also follow us on MySpace. So that about wraps it up for this how-to video tutorial today. Stay tuned for more new, new uh, PageRage video tutorials on our YouTube channel. And be sure once again to follow us on Twitter.